hello everyone thanks for tuning in to auto surgeon and in this vlog we have a diy project in our hands it is nothing but an installation of an armrest on a 2018 volkswagen polo there are two types of oem armrests available in the market one with the cup holders and the other without but keep in mind the installation is entirely different the one without cup holders are easy to fix and can be done just by removing the trim piece behind the handbrake here we have the one with the cup holders the vlog is into two parts and in part one we show the unboxing and in the second the diy itself watch the vlog till the end as i have been longing this for quite some time The whole package consists of four contents, the armrest base, the armrest itself, cup holder bracket and the screw sets. The armrest base has a fixed offset bolt on it and is a pretty sturdy piece. It is bolted onto the chassis using the four screw holes as shown. Next up is the end piece trim along with the cup holder bracket which can easily accommodate a 1 litre bottle in it. Both of these are made of high quality plastic and feels pretty tough and well built. The adjustable armrest comes with a built-in storage space and its interior is really soft and velvety. The top of the armrest has a plushy and well cushioned surface and is capable to provide those comfortable long drives. Now let's check the screws provided with it. There are 4 T20 screws that has to be bolted onto the chassis as shown. A hex nut which has to be bolted on top of the offset screw is also provided. The tiny Allen screw goes inside the cup holder and needs some skill to fix it, which can be quite time consuming. Now let's quickly see a demo on how to fix the armrest. To get a better idea where the screw actually goes. This is actually a two-man job, but with correct set of tools, it can be carried out quite easily by yourself. Let's begin. Carefully pry up the piece behind the handbrake using the pry tool as seen. This would reveal a new screw just behind the handbrake adjuster. Now using a ratchet, unscrew the lone screw carefully and place it aside.
after which you will have to pull up the tab below the handbrake. You won't be needing any tool for this one. Next up, carefully pry up the gear shift cover or the gator using a pry tool of your choice. Start from the corner and slowly work your way around. Two new screws will be revealed as seen. Using the Torx screw head, carefully remove these screws. Remember to store all of these screws safely. Now using the opening tool, pry open the trim around the stereo at the points as seen. You can then slowly release the trim from the center console by working your way around it. Similarly, remove the trim around the AC control unit by starting at the bottom. Pry at the corner points and slowly release the trim. This would now reveal a pair of another screws. Using the Torx head, remove these screws as well. Now this part is a little tricky. You will be removing a large plastic piece of trim from your center console. You need to press down on these two large plastic tabs. While pressing down on the tabs, you need to grab the trim around the cup holders and slide it straight back. Two more screws will now be revealed for removal. In the front of the cup holders, remove the two screws that have been exposed. You can now lift the entire piece of trim that stretches from here to the front. Slide the base of the armrest under the trim and into position. There are four holes on the base that line up with the four screw holes that were factory drilled into the floor of the car. Using a ratchet set, you should be able to screw down the base with the four Torx 20 screws that are supplied with the armrest.
drop the trim back down and put back the lone screw. After which, remember to put the small plastic piece of trim in place. This is supplied with the armrest. You can now set the armrest down on the armrest base. It should easily click into place. Screw down this nut using the ratchet set and you are good to go. Now attach the cup holder part to the back of the armrest as shown. First touch the top part of the cup holder to the armrest and pivot it down to close. You will hear a click when it gets attached. Congratulations, you have now successfully installed the GTI spec armrest, but wait you are not done yet you still have to replace all the trims and screws that were removed from the center console just follow the instructions in reverse to make sure you don't miss anything best of luck